Police are asking for the public's help to identify the suspect responsible for vandalizing a gravesite. On Sunday evening, the officers were uh, called to the Holy Rosary Cemetery off of Main Street in East Homo, reference to criminal damage to property. When they arrived, they discovered that a single gravesite had been damaged by vulgar graffiti. The graffiti was written with a black permanent marker. And the suspects also damaged the picture that was on the gravesite, and they took down also all of the cards from loved ones. The officers uh, did patrol the area, however, they didn't locate anyone in the area. Therefore, we're asking if anyone has any information regarding uh, this damage that was done to this gravesite at Holy Rosary um, Cemetery to please call us at 873-6371. Those charged with desecration of graves can be fined up to $500 or face up to six months imprisonment or both. With the graffiti incident occurring approximately one week before the one-year anniversary of Carrie Eshday's death, his family carefully scrubbed away the vulgar markings from their loved one's gravestone on Thursday. They called him a punk and other things, but if he were here, they would not have the strength to face him and say these things to his face. We are thinking that it's someone in his age range, someone who was maybe among his group of friends um, who had a grudge. We're hurt, but I think more than anything, we're disgusted to know that there's actually a person on the face of this earth that can do something like this to someone's loved one's fi final resting place. I just want the person who did this to know that we will get you sooner or later. This is a very small community. The word is already out. Whoever did this will be caught and they will be prosecuted. And I would just like to say for the parents of the person who did this, I'm really sorry for you.